Hey, good afternoon, welcome into the channel. And this video, although being quite a few years old, is a classic, and it's exactly the reason we don't do whatever we wanna do and park wherever we wanna park above the law. This one from Boston, Massachusetts, and Bill Noonan at Bill Noonan Fire Photos. It speaks for itself, I'm sure you guys can tell. Let's go over and check it out. No, it's not snakes in a car, it's hoes in a BMW. The firefighters, you know, did what they had to do. They did it after arriving at a fire involving three apartment houses in East Boston. This BMW was blocking a hydrant, so firefighters smashed two windows and fed the hose through the car. It was a scene right out of the movie Backdraft. Firefighters can't thread the hose under or around the car because it's not very flexible and tends to kink, reducing the flow of water, which is exactly what happened to the hose stuck through the BMW. The car was parked so close to the hydrant that firemen dented it while hooking up. <laughs> the dent, as if it's the worst of his problems. Yeah, I mean, you guys can see how close he was parked to it, why he shouldn't park to it. There's no way for firefighters to get that hose in there. They've got that clamp that has to clamp on, and it's got a, a tightening thing. You just can't be in front of it. That's all it is. And it hurts my heart that it's a BMW. I do drive, actually, two BMWs. I have an SUV in a car, and I. Uh, it hurts my heart because we have a really bad reputation as BMW drivers. Some of us drive properly, park properly, but a lot of... BMW drivers and Mercedes and other high-end people, they just don't. They think they're above everything. So, yeah, that's it. <laughs> to add insult to injury on top of BMW windows, five, six hundred bucks a window. I drove a car similar to that. I've had quite a few BMWs. And uh, the dent in the side of that car is thousands of dollars. I mean, that's that car is going to need five, six, seven, eight thousand dollars worth of work and a hundred dollar fire hydrant parking ticket to add insult. Salt in the wound. This happens every once in a while, and it's been happening for decades. But whenever it happens, it's greeted with something approaching glee. This is what happens to the cars of morons who park in front of hydrants. The Toucher and Rich radio show got a text from a firefighter not involved in the Boston fire. We all secretly pray for the chance to do what the brothers in Boston got to do with that Beamer last night. <laughs> Classic. Good for you. And though the spokesman for the Boston Fire Department kept saying... We certainly didn't take any, any pleasure in doing this. <laughs> oh, yes, they did. They absolutely took a lot of pleasure in it. Online posters disagreed. As a former firefighter, we love doing this to jackasses. BMW equals break my window, park in front of a fire plug, and you'll risk getting hosed. <laughs> Genimo, CNN. New York. Yeah, you guys, this is why we don't do it. It's why we don't park in front of them. Not only is it just being a douchebag and is it endangering people that the firefighters need access to that water to help save, it's going to risk getting your car completely demolished. So uh, whether it's a BMW or Mercedes or some other vehicle, it could be a Honda or a Toyota or whatever, they don't care. They'll throw that, that hose right through your window, lock, stock, and barrel you'll be over with. So that's why we don't do it, guys. Perfect example of... You're stopping the fire department from getting water that they need to put out that fire that was going on that actually was happening, even though that person that parked there in that Beamer probably doesn't even live there, or if they do, they may not even live in the building that burnt down. They might have lived across, uh, you know, across the, the street sidewalk there, and the fire hydrant just happened to be on their side. Number of reasons, but there you go. So enjoy the video. As always, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel, you guys. I'm going to have such great footage. In fact, I've got one little surprise for all of you guys. We're going to be going out to some of these parking lots, and we're going to be doing a little bit of, um, yeah, you know it, drone footage. We're going to uh, we're going to pop the Mavic out. We're going to uh, we're going to unfold this, and we're going to uh, fly it over top of um, some of these illegal parking during holiday Christmas season shopping 
and, uh, and get some of their reactions as we fly above them to point out that they are indeed not parked where they should. It should be awesome. I'm going to get some of this drone footage. Uh, it's raining today, or I'd actually go out there today, but um, that's it. That's the update from the video, so make sure you're subscribed to the channel so you don't miss future videos, and until those videos, I will see everyone next time.